Whenever you hear YouTube.com, chances are the first thing that pops into your head are cute animal videos and people hurting themselves. <laughs> but there's more to it than that. YouTube is a global empire, launched in 53 countries across 61 languages. YouTube has grown from a project with three employees above a pizza shop to the third most visited website in the world behind Facebook and Google. It has amassed a viewership of 800 million unique viewers each month and has started what has been called the Age of Internet-tainment. It broke down walls that were previously daunting for content creators to show that normal people can become and create great things with a few ideas, a video camera, and a voice. And to think, this all started out of a need for three former PayPal employees to share videos easily and a nerd that didn't have a date on Valentine's Day. YouTube has changed many things about how our society views entertainment. Almost every time the comment question is asked, what's your favorite TV show? You'll see multiple comments from people saying that they've given up on television. The reasoning that usually follows the statement is that you have more control over what you watch and when you watch it. Not to mention the added perk of having no more than 30 seconds of ads on what you watch. YouTube changed the way you control your entertainment. Every episode of your favorite series available on one platform whenever you want, in one playlist that cues videos automatically, and you can stop and come back to it whenever you want. YouTube changed people's expectations of how entertainment could be created and viewed. People love YouTube, and YouTube loves people. The name of the site is centered around the basis that you are the creator. With the registering of YouTube in 2005, Chad Hurley, Steve Chen, and Jod Karam created a universal platform that didn't exist before, where viewers and creators could go to be entertained. And with 72 hours of video being uploaded every minute, there's no shortage of what you can see. Video genres that may not have been looked at twice for television thrive and sometimes hold together YouTube. One of the best examples is what's called vlogging. Think of it like a journal, but with videos. Most major YouTubers have a vlogging channel. It allows them to connect with their fans and share their daily life. One of the extreme examples is the channel CTFXC, also known as Internet Killed Television. You gotta do the labyrinth walk. Yeah. Looking for David Bowie. Charles and Ali Trippi have posted a vlog every single day without failure since May 1st, 2009. This means that on March 19th, 2013, Charles and Allie will have uploaded 1,419 videos showing their lives every single day. I don't think you can do it. Using your hands. No. Without using my hands. No. Watch. Oh my god. You may be wondering who would watch two people carrying around a camera all day filming what they're doing. The answer is me. Yeah. I've spent around 233 hours of my life watching Charles and Allie. It may seem like a waste of time to some people, but I, along with about 700,000 others, tune in every day to see what these people did. Oh god! Two! Oh my god! Okay. Don't count to three, just you have to like one, two, four. I like did one. one, two, and rip. You didn't. I know three's after two. Okay, fine, one. <laughs> Their vlogs have shown everything from Charles getting a brain tumor to his engagement to Ali when they were living in Spain studying abroad. It's gonna be a beautiful day. Yeah. <laughs> yes. <laughs> she said yes. Of course I said yes. I love you. I love you more. It's not all over my face right now. The videos have also showcased their days of fun and what was called the royal wedding of YouTube. When you try your best but you don't succeed When you get what you want but not what you need Health and sickness and Health and sickness Through sorrow and success Through sorrow and success 
for all the days of my life. For all the days of my life. <laughs> for all the days of my life. Charles and Ellie's wedding hashtag was trending on Twitter for 12 hours longer worldwide than the actual royal wedding of Will and Kate. This shows the power of a truly dedicated video audience. We've been known to crash websites when YouTubers are up for awards, and even take down Congress, should we so please. YouTube brings people together with common interests and gives people the freedom to do what they genuinely love. Whether that's entertaining people or just sitting in their dark rooms, calmly playing their favorite video games. YouTube brings people together with common interests and gives people the freedom to do what they love and interact with people that share those same interests. People have said that they started making YouTube videos out of boredom, and many more have said that it helped them find themselves or stop being so shy. Many of those people that say that now have made a job out of YouTube, which can be a good or a bad thing. Very gradually as this YouTube thing has become my job, I now find myself doing pretty much anything I possibly can to avoid it. But remember, these people are getting paid to make videos on YouTube. Once you're part of the community, you can never really feel the same way about another website. YouTube has solidified as well as spread the idea of equality and being able to voice your own thoughts. The Arab Spring that started in 2010 was spurred on strongly with social media and YouTube. Starting with Tunisia, the Arab Spring was centered around people wanting better human rights, free elections, and changes in power. News was hard to come by when the governments tried to isolate the countries and gain control again, but people talk. And record. Videos uploaded to YouTube help show the struggles of the people to gain control of their lives from themselves and their families. They help spread the message to nearby countries that were under strict rulers that there was a chance to be free of oppression. I personally remember logging onto YouTube one day, and a majority of the front page of featured videos were from Tunisia, Egypt, Syria, or Libya. Now people in these countries have better chances at a democratic life for themselves and their families. YouTube has been a driving force for this generation of content creators. It is a truly unique tool that is only limited by governments that are too scared to let their people know what it is to have a voice and our own imagination. Directors, producers, musicians, artists, and people just looking for a way to kill time all contribute to its success. YouTube is a worldwide phenomenon where everybody has a voice and a chance to be heard. It's made today's celebrities and today's libertarians. Everybody is welcome no matter your skin color, political views, or any other so-called limitation. Part of what I love and cherish about the site is that anybody can be great. You guys are this awesome community, not only just for me, but for each other, which is something I am extremely, of all things that I've done on the internet, I am so proud of the fact that we have created together this, this awesome community of people that care for each other, they back each other up, they help each other out, it's, it's awesome. Everybody is welcome on the stage that is YouTube.